Hello everyone, this is XXTheGamerXX, and I am just doing an update on my uniform. And I am wearing one of the uh, navy blue coats, which is, from what I know as, as of right now, is one of the newest uniforms that they have issued out. Um, it's actually one of the most current one that I've seen most military uh, personnel in the army wear. Now, I just wanted to run through uh, some things. Uh, I am pretty excited to tell you guys that I have been promoted to Master Sergeant a couple weeks ago, uh, a little bit more than a couple weeks because I, I got promoted before winter break. Uh, I am a little sick today, so uh, sorry for sniffing all the way through the video if I do. Uh, basically, I just wanted to give you a rundown of what I have. Um, most of you guys already know what the heck all this means, uh, but most people don't. So I'll just run through it. Basically, this is a Master Sergeant, like I mentioned before. It's uh, three chevrons, three bars. Um, basically, yeah. So uh, these are the torches you know, knowledge and stuff like that. I'm not gonna get too in depth on what everything means. I'll just give you the down to the bottom line, what it means. Uh, this tan or sand core, whatever you wanna call it, um, looks more brass than anything. Um, it's basically the marksmanship cord. And uh, I have this one that goes over uh, this little patch here. Um, and basically that signifies that I'm the I'm the marksmanship captain or leader if you will if you will. Um and this is pretty much what it looks like. I do not know why this is like this, but that's just the way it came. Um uh this is also my name in the Jerry DC. I am Mas Cadet Master Sergeant Sandoval. Um this is our unit uh this is our unit crest, and this is uh, this little star means honor unit with distinction, uh, which is one of the highest you can get. Uh, this right here is color guard, and basically what it means is that if I can just get it, yeah, there you go, color guard. And basically what that means is I'm the one uh, either holding the United States or Texas flag or holding a rifle. And I am either left or right guard. I prefer, I, eh, I can't speak today. I prefer being right guard. Um, I'm trying to become the commander uh, for one team of the color guard so I can, you know, carry the American flag. That's what every color guard member wants to do is carry the American flag. Even though that's the most difficult because you're the one giving the commands it's it's something to have and and it's it's really something to be proud of when you become it uh not that any other position is not uh supposed to be being proud but you know that's just the way it is um this is rifle team which is basically the same thing as marksmanship um most people get this confused for arm team which is uh uh the same well not the same thing uh it's basically um Arm team is basically where you hold all rifles. It's nothing but rifles in the team. Um, my team, it's the same thing. They were nothing but rifles, but we are air rifles, which is the rifle team. Uh, hold on. So like uh, like I was saying, I had to edit some of this out. Um, like rifle team. Uh, like I said before, it's basically just marksmanship just in a different way of saying it. That's pretty much all it is. And over here, you have a female color guard cord because we do not have any more um, male color guard cords, which the male one looks very similar to this, except it goes underneath. Kind of like this one is right here. It goes underneath. That's pretty much what the color guard one looks like, except it'll be white like. Uh, like this thick rope right here, but it would go underneath. Okay, so 
Uh, I've been in Color Guard for her around two years. I've been in I've been in marksmanship for already three years now. Considering that this is my third year being in JROTC, uh, this is my uh, third year being technically in marksmanship, and this is technically my second year being in color guard. And uh, I also got these two because I went to more than three competitions, uh, and. I don't know if we placed or not because I never really paid attention, but yeah. And um, also over here, if you noticed, I have ribbons and one medal. And sorry for the crookedness of the ribbons and the medals. I am using very weird ribbon racks. And this medal is uh, pretty hard to center because it's just a metal piece in the back. It's very hard to center. Um, uh, okay, so basically, a uh, little rundown, um, I'm not very good at remembering my ribbons, so if I make a mistake, let me know, okay, so basically, um, I believe this one right here is perfect attendance, I'm not really sure, uh, this one right here is let service, this one right here is personal appearance, uh, rifle team, which is marksmanship pretty much. And this one right here is color guard. This one right here is, I think, a JCLC ribbon. I don't know which kind of JCLC ribbon it is, but it's one of them, I think. This is another JCLC ribbon. This is good conduct. This one is... Another JCLC ribbon, uh, all three of these right here are JCLC. Um, this one is a parade ribbon, and this one is for recruiting uh, an, an X amount of number of cadets. Uh, and the sad part is this year we don't have as many cadets, so uh, yeah, we went down from like 300 and something all the way down to like 100 and something because of inspection this year. No one wants to do inspection. Oh man, I'm so sick. And um, you got this medal. I got this uh, specially made. Um, I have the plaque on why I got it. Uh, basically, a rundown is that I gave a lot of support to the organization. I try to help out as much as I can. And uh, I really did a lot. And it, it was really hard to get all of this stuff. I'm very proud of it. Um, it was it was hard. Uh, freshman year, actually, uh, I was a private first class, which is basically one of these little roof things, which is basically a chevron, and one of these little bars, which is a uh, a bar, right? Okay. So uh, uh, my freshman year, I got to that because I passed the PFC test right off the bat, and then I moved up and I skipped corporal and went straight to sergeant. Um, which is three chevrons, uh, because I passed the sergeant's board, and um, that's pretty much it. I stayed at that rank for freshman year and sophomore year, <laughs> and yeah, so that's another story that I will tell you um, about why I stayed a sergeant for freshman and sophomore year. Uh, that's another story for another time. But other than that, yeah, this is my uniform. Sorry for the dirtiness. Um, I was trying to keep it clean, but, uh, you know, I have dogs. So when I get to the ROTC room, I'm going to use a lint roller and clean it all up. Um, but, yeah, uh, as you can see here, I am very proud of what I have. Um, and also all the buttons here have... The United States Army logo on it. Uh, all of them have it. So, yeah. Um, that's about it. Later, guys. Sorry for wasting around 10 minutes of your life. Later, guys, and hopefully I can make another video soon. Peace.